making the connection between verbal reasoning and logical reasoning. You should not feel both are separate. No. Reasoning is a just a part. Either it will be asked in the form of verbal reasoning or logical reasoning or non-verbal reasoning. All are same. All are same. And during today's session, I will just tell you what are the factors. Only four factors are there and four different, different area is there or four different uh, channels are there which will mix in different, different way to make the verbal reasoning, logical reasoning and non-verbal reasoning. Okay. But basically, to define the logic, most lucid definition or most lucid way of understanding in my, my point of view, it is analysis of argument is logic if any argument is there if you are analyzing that argument with the help of critical thinking then it is a called logic now what is critical thinking that itself a, again very interesting topic to discuss and uh, because this is too much important for your life and career and cat preparation in verbal section i have taken one complete session related to critical thinking because it is going to affect very vast way or very large way your verbal preparation then critical thinking is much much important due to i have taken one complete session what is thinking what is critical thinking and how you can convert your ordinary thinking into a superb thinking and critical thinking another point will be involved understand the assumptions assumptions also should have certain base we can't assume like a without based on without any any base or without any logic assumptions also having like india will win cricket world cup 2023 what is our assumptions assumption is whatever performance today is there based on that we are assuming everything circumstances are in favor if, uh, if, if performance of team will be continued till 2023 india certainly will win cricket world cup that is our assumption that is our assumption if this is not this if this is not happened or performance of team has gone down this assumption cannot be valid this assumption cannot be valid then assumption also having certain references we can't do blind assumption how to assume and how much we have to assume and what is the degree of assumption positive and negative these all are important to analyze the argument to convert the argument into a powerful logic argument or sometimes it is you can say yeah, so many differences are there between argument statement premises facts all are having different one but for your for for your level or for cat preparation level all you can just make it is a one form either we are telling facts argument a statement all you can consider it is a same then after to analyze the, all these things to convert into a powerful logic understanding the assumption is one of the important tool if you are not able to understand then what will happen your logic will not proper you will do the mistake to make the conclusion a reasonable logic applied to analyze the argument based on the basic math and common sense assumption will be just like a common sense if we are solving the logical reasoning question our assumption will be like a common sense or you can say basic mathematical understanding what is critical thinking critical thinking will play the same role if you are solving logical reasoning like a very fundamental math i will show you a few examples just i will finish the, this thought then you will get uh, one idea how to proceed further this facts argument premises statement principles all you can consider the same although it is having big differences although it is having some differences but for your level or whatever what level uh, you are doing the cat preparation no need to differentiate what is the premises what is difference between premises this is part of philosophy we can keep apart even uh, related to logic if you will go then total 36 type of a statement can be generated can you believe it and one book i read that is tot totally only based on the logic and how to frame the statement that book is not 100 page or 50 pages that book itself a 450 pages but no need to go in that level because based on my interest i am reading and I am trying to get more idea about each and everything. But here you can consider facts, argument, premises, statement, principles. If you are applying the common sense, basic principles of math, we will be able to conclude. And that conclusion is your logical reasoning. Here few images are there. You can just go through. Argument, whenever we are telling you, don't feel it is a fighting. Like uh, boy and girl are fighting or husband and wife are fighting. I am right. I, I am not right. Or me too. This it, Argument is not like that. Generally, one negative concept, concept is there. 
whenever we are telling argument argument means we are fighting to each other no difference of opinion maybe but here meaning of argument is there one raw fact one fact in the form of raw we are keeping and based on the critical thinking and based on the assumptions we are converting into conclusion okay then here what is the critical thinking skills here so many skills will be needed reasoning will be needed evaluation will be needed problem solving this is again separate area and one complete session is there in your in your uh, verbal uh, you can say vr vr section that is related to your critical thinking how to think critically that is much much important how to become a critical thinker what is the ladder to become an ordinary thinker to master thinker or critical thinker these all are just for eye opener now just we'll take few examples very simple these all are you can say just what we are using here here we are just doing multiplication and subtraction 6 into 5 30 minus 2 28 9 into 9 7 into 6 don't need to say this is your non-verbal reasoning i am giving one just example one simple anyway it is a not helpful for your cat preparation but one thing you keep in your mind maybe you are preparing for bank PO or you are preparing not preparing anything non-verbal reasoning any point of time if you are facing anywhere or any circumstances or maybe somebody is asking to you you can't say i'm not i'm not i'm not aware of this type of question you will able to help you this is not a big thing what we can use just use your observation in your in your observation what what are the variable here if anything coming under non-verbal reasoning four five factors only is there only five factors are there that can be changed one is shape another is size another is direction another is your spatial location another is their color or uh, you can say change in position color and change in position that much only can be possible these five things only can be possible no need to know no need to practice if you want to just take this fact and you appear for any exam you will be able to solve 100 percent correct what is there nothing here like this arrow is there this is changing like this in this arrow earlier it was upward now it is going downward first one is same second situation what is happening this is also changing and this is also changing over in this only orientation changing nothing color is same shape size everything same it is no number number also same only orientation changing second example like just we can go this is changing correct next time this will also change this will also change over next we can say this is changed okay this is not changed next this also will change this also will change means both will come downward we can mark option b for this any special training needed or you can say some point of time if somebody approach you one of the student i am preparing for bank for you you are preparing for cats just just help me for few questions is it right to tell i am not aware about the non-verbal reasoning no you can help it you can help it you can help them there is not a big thing similar way these all are the just part of small thinking of logic